that. So I blew it. I told her friends I get my beak wet. Oh. God, this is so frustrating. It really is. You're trying all week, but it's working so hard. Anything, man. Hey, you can't rush Inspirado. It comes when it comes, but still. Yeah, but what are we supposed to be like the little engine that could just keep on keeping on? Hey guys. Oh, boy. Oh, okay. Hold nope, on. Nope. He's walking over. He's almost here. Okay. Okay. Be nice. Hey, guys. How you doing? Taking a break? Yeah. Yeah, hence no music. Oh. <laughs> well, whatever you were playing sounded great. Thank you. Thanks. So what's up? Oh, not much. I've just been working on a Tesla coil over in my garage. Huh? I heard you guys play, and I thought I'd come say hi. That was nice. Well, uh... Yeah, we've just been having a little writer's block at the moment. I, uh, been a little bit of a funk since we lost that battle with bands. We're trying to find ourselves. Have you guys ever tried meditating? We're <laughs> not the fucking Beatles. Meditating. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What about, like, a brainstorm web? The brain... No. That just sounds like too much work. What about an herbal cleansing? You're talking about a mushroom trip. They didn't have a bad idea. A uh, mushroom what? Nothing. Sorry about that. Yeah, no, it doesn't at all. Well, oh, I'm gonna go back inside. Trying to get some work done. Bye, Nathan. Do you wanna see the coil? I. I probably should get back to work too. I gotta prime my drums with drum and grease and that's it. Talk to you later, Ryan. Yeah, talk to you later. Bye, there. Alright, well if you guys need anything, I'll be next door. I'll be working on my coil in the garage. If you need anything, I'll be over here. Maybe I'll see you guys later tonight or tomorrow maybe or who knows. Bye! I'll be here if you need me. Hey, what's up? from the hood? Yeah, I'm going to check see what the ghosts are going to get my hands on. Better protect myself. Oh. And you're learning this from movies? Yeah, why not? No reason? Other than the fact that they're fictitious? Well, oh, shit, sheer lie. There's pure evidence of that kind of stuff out there. I'm just not too convinced still, okay? What do you got for me, though? Oh, boy, the monster. Sweet! Seriously? That's like the best part. No biggie. Probably just blew a fuse. Boy, a fuse was this? 1982? You, you know what I mean. You just go and switch it back on and I'll be back. Put that stupid ghost, I swear to God, I'm gonna punch in that stupid face. You'll be fine, you'll be fine. Wish me luck. Mm. We're good. Okay, we're right there? I'm good, I'm okay. I'll be back. I wonder if you knew this flashlight was here. You got a flashlight? Not now, dude. That goes back. I think I shit myself. No, 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 no. I busted my ankle, and you got a flashlight yeah, this whole time. Give, it to you. give me that. God. Now look, dude. There's nothing in here. See? There's nothing here. 
It's just your imagination. Your vivid and wild imagination. See, dude, if you get a hold of yourself, your mind can't get a hold of you. Fine, fine, all right. Stop leaning so close to me. I'm over here, dude. Then who's... What did I miss? Damn, that skull's gonna get you! Uh, watch this. <laughs> now you can't catch what you can't see. Isn't it like Spirit 101? Holy shit, you got him! Yep. Holy shit, you fixed the lights! Yep. Holy shit, you're home! Yeah! Just in time it seems. Yep. Hey, d -Rick. Yep. I mean, hey, how's it going, guys? So what did I miss? Well, you had to turn the lights back on. Well, see, it's this crazy thing. It's called a switch. You flip it upwards, it turns all the lights on. Uh, it does have a point. I went downstairs and I checked the fuse box, and there was nothing wrong with it. Is is that after you jackass your foot on the chair? Shut up. But yes. Okay, guys. Now remember, this switch is an energy saver. It controls all the power in this room. So say we're going on a trip or a vacation, and we didn't want to unplug everything. Bam, easy switch. Flip it off, all the power's out. I like that. Mm, that's a wholesome idea. I'm not gonna lie, we've been living here a couple weeks and I didn't even know that existed. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about this, uh, this light switch as I am concerned about the grossly dressed figure underneath my foot. See, I told you I wasn't crazy. Thing is certain to people in an apology. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, you were right. Kind of. May not have been a ghost, but it certainly fooled you into thinking it was one. Damn right. Now, d -Rick. <sighs> Sorry that I scrutinized your grossly episodes, Nathan. Yeah, I'll take that as an apology. So, gentlemen, what do you say we unmask this fool and lay into him before we get about doing anything? Unless it's a woman. I'll... Yeah, I'll say that's a good idea. For all the callous night terrors and my pair of pants. Wait, wait, wait. So, you guys don't want to, like, try to before the fact, like, we try to scooby do it? No, I just want to lay in this. No, wait, 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 wait. He's got a point. Let's see where this is going. Okay, guys, so here's how it started. The first morning after this whole ordeal started, I was leaving for work. As we were poking fun at Nathan, I noticed that there was mud trap by the side door. I just assumed it was one of you guys. Yeah, I remember that now. I thought it was Nathan, though. Why does it have to be me? What makes either of you think that I did it? Because I didn't do it. Yeah, and neither did I. Well, it wasn't me. I know, I'm getting to that. Can I please get back to my montage? Sorry. Okay, wait for it. Okay, the fade's done. Back to the montage. About time. Ryan! Sorry. Anyways. A few days later we had a jam session, and then we took that smoke break. Well, I saw the same footprint left in the mud, only this time I saw who left it. Okay, now this is the part where we can chime in and give our guesses, right? Yes. Yes it is. I'm gonna go with Old Man Withers from the amusement park. Just no. Ooh, ooh, ooh! I know, I know, I know! Could it be the creepy condoms guy from work? Truth is, though, it's none other than our neighbor. Bias. What? Seriously? Yep. Hi, guys. Tobias, what the hell are you doing here? I wanted to teach you guys a lesson. What? Why? Why? I came over here the other day to welcome you into the neighborhood. You guys gave me the cold shoulder. No, we didn't. What? Yes, he did. Who, me? Yeah, you. Don't mind Ryan. You probably didn't even mean it that way. He's just being a dad. He's super worried about our future. 
yeah, I, I didn't mean it. I was just, I've been so focused on us writing our song lately, and it's just, I... You can't rush art. Even I know that. Our next song's coming. I can feel it. Well, I'm sorry, Tobias. At least, at least I can learn something out of all this. Yeah. You know, friendship should never supersede the band's motivations. Mm -hmm. I mean, after all, that is why we started Werewolves by Night, isn't it? Yep. And picked up some ladies. You both have valid points. I appreciate both of them for what they are. But we also joined the band so we can get drunk all the time. So how about we get drunk right now? Sounds good I'm to me. I'm freaking dead. Do you guys mind if I hang out? Yeah, I don't care. Mm -hmm. Fuck you. Well, I guess it all worked out in the end then, huh? And we learned a valuable lesson. Yes, we did. <laughs> Why don't we all just share a laugh about it? <laughs> <laughs> Damn! You knocked him out cold! Thought you guys were all good! You Hans Baker, shit, you pulled up? Where's the logic in that? Sometimes, maybe there isn't a logic to it all. Well, they're so crazy. You probably just didn't think that through. Can we just sit down, smoke your joint, and watch TV now, please? Well, we were watching Tales from the Hood. See? Now that's what I'm talking about. based on true events. Alright. Just like we rehearsed. I got a little something for you guys. One, two, three! Huh!